Right, welcome back. So we've been running the configuration about the action group, right? So let's just go through our config and see if we have got any errors. Uh, we've got a bunch of errors. I am not sure why did I put in over here. I, I was referring the documentation parallelly on the other screen. And, um, this needs to be pretty similar to what we already have been doing. I think there's a typo over here. Uh, this is going to be I over here and I over here also okay perfect so what I've done is for each um, iterate through this name each dot value value this would be the name then resource group the similar way short name with this one I'm using a dynamic for each so this is uh, email receiver if you weren't been using uh, dynamic you would simply be typing your email receiver and start defining your email address over here but that's going to be very manual in order to automate this because I want to have multiple email addresses uh, what I've done is I've used used a dynamic okay what I've done is I've used a dynamic block over here wherein I'm iterating through this particular variable and using um, the variable to iterate through the object inside the array and same I'm doing for uh, uh, content also wherein I'm um, iterating through um, the email email receiver through this email address and then the name okay let's try to spin up our terminal and do a terraform inet all right this is initialized the dot terraform folder is created now i'm going to do a terraform plan and i am just gonna apply the configuration if we have everything correctly populating okay so it says that the email is gonna be okay online number 20 okay i just need to remove this because I was showing this as a part of our example to you folks so just gonna do a plan and let's see if this time it should be able to successfully uh, plan and tell us that this is the action group under this particular resource group it's gonna create okay um, I already trust that you already have some sort of idea about action group so we've got the plan added okay so it's creating the resource group and it is attaching the action group underneath this resource group so what I'm going to do is I uh, just going to apply this auto approve hit enter and this should start applying our configuration right over here. So within a few seconds we should have a new resource group with the name as monitoring action resource group and if you go to this underneath any resource group um, we would have some sort of um, underneath the alerts we need should have the action uh, alert rule or rather action group created um we're just going to wait for a couple of uh, minutes and then the next session i'm going to show you once the resources are created and i'm going to uh, publish a new change also wherein we're going to use a web hook probably you can post in these messages on to matter most or any any other group groups like teams group as well so in the next session once this is created i'm going to show you how you could just append those settings in the configuration as well i'll see you in a while thank you